Hey guys, welcome again to my vlog. So this is the chapter 6 network layer. Chapter 6 section and objectives. 6.1 is network layer protocols. Describe the purpose of the network layer in the data communication. Explain why the IPv4 protocol requires the other layer to provide reliability. Explain the role of the major header fields in the IPv4 and the IPv6 packet. 6.2 routing. Explain how a host devices uses routing tables to direct packets to itself, a local destination, or a default gateway. Compare a host routing table to a route. Explain the role of the major header fields in the IPv4 and the IPv6 packet. 6.2 routing. Explain how a host devices uses routing tables to direct packets to itself, a local destination, or a default gateway. Compare a host routing table to a routing table in a router. 6.3 routers. Describe the common components and interfaces of a router. Describe the boot up process of a Cisco IOS router. 6.4 Configure a Cisco router. Configure initial settings on a Cisco IOS router. Configure two active interfaces on a Cisco IOS router. Next is the configure devices to use the default gateway. 6.1 Layer Protocol Network layer in communication. The network layer end-to-end -end transport processes. Addressing end devices. Encapsulation. Routing. The encapsulation. Network layer protocol. IPv4 and IPv6. So is, this is the network layer protocol. The exchange of data. Characteristic of the IP protocol. Encapsulating IP Segments are encapsulated into IP packets for transmissions The network layer adds a header so packet can be routed to the destination So next is the IP connectionless Sender doesn't know if the receiver is listening or the message arrive on time Receiver doesn't know the data is coming. IP best effort delivery. No guarantees of delivery are made. So IPv6 packet. Limitation of IPv4. IP address depletion. Internet routing table expansion. Lack of end-to-end -end connectivity. Introducing IPv6 increase address space, improve packet handling, eliminates the path need or not, encapsulation IPv6, simplified header format, no checksum process requirement, more efficient option header mechanism. 6.2 routing. Host forwarding decision. Three types of destination. Itself, local host, remote host. Next is um, default gateway. Routes traffic to other networks. Has a local IP address in the same address range or other host of the network. Can take data in the forward data out. Next is the using the default gateway. Host will use the default gateway when sending packet to remote networks. So, how a host routes router routing tables. Router packet forwarding decision. Can take data in the forward data out. Next is the using the default gateway. Host will use the default gateway when sending packet to remote networks. So, how a host routes router routing tables? Router packet forwarding decision. Have a four steps. The first is router and 
post forward packet in the similar fashion. The main difference is the that rotor have more interfaces and while host open have only one. Devices on directly connected network can be reached directly. Devices on the remote network are reached through gateway. IPv4 rotor routing table. The, rot the rotor routing tables stores network routes the rotor knows about use the show IP route command to display the routing table on a Cisco rotor. The rotor routing table also has information on how the route was learned its trustworthiness and rating. It also contains which interface to use to reach the specific destination. Next is the directly connected routing table entries, the C and the L. The C is the identifies a directly connected network, automatically created when the interface is configured with an IP address and activated. L is identifies that this is a local interface. This is the IPv4 address of the interface on the router. Remote network routing tables entries. So, remote destination remote destination can be reached is directly. Remote routes contains the IP of the intermediate network device to be used to reach the destination. Next hub address. Next hub, next hub address is the address of the intermediate device used to reach the specific remote destination. 6.3 6 routers. Anatomy of a router. A router is a computer. Routers have CPU memory and I.O. devices. Cisco routers use iOS as their operating system. Rotor memory. Just a computer, rotors have memory. Rotor contain RAM, ROM, and NVRAM and flash memory. Inside the rotor. Rotor have the same general structure. Connect to a rotor. Rotor have a main port to support connections. LAN and WAN interfaces. Rotors have local area network and the wireless area network port. Different models ship the different port. Ethernet is very common on different routers models. Boot set files. iOS image files stored in the flash contains the iOS. The flash also stored other system files. NVRAM store configuration parameters. Router boot up process. Perform the post and load the bootstrap program. Locate and load the Cisco IOS software. Locate and load the startup configuration file or enter setup mode. So 6.4 configuration in Cisco Router. Configure initial settings. Basic switch configuration steps. Configuration device name. Secure exec mode. Secure BTY lines. Secure privilege exec mode. Secure all password. Provide legal notification. <coughs> Save the configuration. Basic rotor configuration steps. Configure device name. Secure exec mode. Secure VTY line, secure privilege mode, secure all password, provide legal notification, configure management SVY, save the configuration. Default gateway for a switch, a default gateway is required for remote network. <coughs> save the configuration, basic router configuration steps, configure device name, secure exec mode. Secure VTY line, secure privilege mode, secure all password, provide legal notification, configure management SVY, save the configuration. Default gateway for a switch, a default gateway is required for remote network communications. If a switch is to be managed by uh, to a 
its BTY lines, it needs to a default gateway. Use the IP default gateway command to configure the default gateway for a switch. So that's all for the chapter 6. So I hope you learned something from my blog. So thank you. Bye.